Where did all the good men go? A lot of them are in the friend zone where you left them. The other thing is, as you said, 20, 30 year olds are still into smoking and partying. Well, those guys right there are gonna have to go through a whole bunch of shit in their lifetime until they get to be about my age and turn out to be great men. Hey, what's up everybody? This is Boone Nakuzi of the Couple Club Podcast. As you guys know, I host a dating relationship podcast with many modern women. And the majority of these modern women all believe there are no more biological roles anymore. Gender is fluid. A man doesn't need to be strong to become a provider and protector, to become a logical leader, because modern women can fulfill those roles. So instead, modern women are telling men, it's okay to be weak, to be emotional, to be vulnerable. You know what, men? You can stay at home while she goes out there and become the breadwinner. And the woman can lead her man while the man is submissive to her. So what's happening today, a lot of young men are growing up and they're confused because their biology is telling them one thing and the women are telling them another. So we have a whole generation of men who are emotionally weak, undisciplined, who run away from hardships and their responsibilities as a man. We have a whole generation of men who are no longer ambitious, who are content with letting their woman work while they chill at home. And we have a whole generation of men who are submissive, AKA simping to their woman. And you know what's ironic? The same modern women who enabled these men turn around and complain, where are all the good, responsible, strong, masculine men? I swear you can't make this shit up. Look, if women want to act like men and men want to act like women, hey, be my guest. It's your own life. But understand there are consequences to those choices because a lot of young men are growing up and taking the advice of these women and finding out the hard way, either through a breakup, a divorce, or a lack of selection, that these women, if they're being honest, are not sexually attracted to them and don't respect them. So if you're a young man out there and want to become a good, strong, quality man, you only become that by fulfilling your biological role as a man, by learning how to be a competent leader, provider, protector. Also, as hard as life is, you can't dwell in your emotions and live in fear your whole life. Get up, be ambitious, be courageous, challenge yourself, find your purpose. That's how you become a man of value to society. And lastly, surround yourself and listen to other good, strong, masculine, responsible men, not these delusional women. Anyways, if you agree or disagree, I invite you guys to be part of this week's Cover Club Podcast live show on YouTube this Wednesday, January 12th at 9 p.m. California time. The Zoom links below. I'm going to be joined with a panel of Polynesian men. We're going to break all these down. See you guys there. Facts over feelings. Peace.